So I'm going to give you my thoughts on all of these items. Let's start with the Revlon Styler. I have a dedicated video for this particular product, so definitely head over and check that one out. It should be up soon if it isn't already. Same with the Maybelline Gigi Hadid collaboration. I will have a dedicated video of my thoughts on these products along with swatches and kind of like product use. Moving on to the items in the tray. The Sephora Favorites Glow Kit, I felt like these ones didn't really do that much. Same with the Benetint, but I loved the Tarte, the Bobbi Brown, the Becca, and the Cover FX. Those were all amazing. Next, we have the Nude Kit. I was really impressed with most of these products. The colors are all ever so slightly different, but they are all beautiful and very wearable. Next we have the e.l.f. 3-in-1 mascara and I do have a dedicated review and try on video for this product so check that out if you want to see how this applies. Next we have the Bare Minerals Powder Duo. This does give you a nice glow, has a hint of glitter, um, but it's good and the H&M powders are both too light for my face so I ended up having to use these with a bronzer over it very heavily so just keep that in mind I got porcelain and ivory. Next we have the holiday kit from Pixie by Petra. I should mention that all of the center section are shimmers, there are no mattes, but stay tuned for a full review and tutorial using this palette. Next we have the Marc Jacobs Marvelous Mousse Foundation. I have to say I really enjoyed this. If you'd like to see a wear test, that is also going up shortly if it's not up already. The Sephora um, concealer was very dry, did crack under my eyes. I was not a fan. It was too thick for me to work with. Just not an easy use product. I know people love it, but for me it didn't really work. And finally, the Ole Hendrickson facial water. This actually made my skin and cheeks break out, so it didn't keep oils at bay. I feel like it made my skin worse, so I would not recommend it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this wrap-up, and I will see you next week. Bye, guys.